the game? Um, so, I feel like they were picking on me a little bit during the duration of the game. So, um, I feel like I, I knew something was going to come where I had to, you know, respond and make a play. Um, but it was a lot of motions going on throughout the duration of the play. Um, I had my eyes on two, and I'm like, all right, this is my, I'm going to just lock on two and just stay on them. And uh, the rest worked out, man. His rest was history, man. Just uh, tried to go up and make a play for my team. Biggest moment for you personally? Uh, for sure, 100%. Um, I feel like that was probably the biggest, one of the biggest moments of my career here at SC, just to kind of, you know, get a, get a shot, a stop, man, for my team. What did Grinch say to you after that play? <laughs> he, he thought I was Eric um, because of how tall I, how high I jumped. So he was like, <laughs> dude, was that you? And I'm like, yes, coach, I think it was me. I'm pretty sure it was me. But um, he said it was a good play, man, uh, overall. I said it was a good call, man. <laughs> so both best of both worlds. Everybody seems pretty aware of, you know, the pressure that's on defense, the eyes on defense. How have you seen Coach Green just kind of handle that, I guess, especially the last few weeks? What have you seen out of him? Um, we've seen a lot of eagerness, um, eager to come out here and uh, teach us, you know, teach us new schemes and new deals uh, to go out there and compete. Um, and overall, man, just enthusiasm, man. Just excited, excited to get out here and compete with us, man, and, um, you know, just, you know, give us the nuggets and the, the jewels to go out there and compete. Your, your, two, your two toughest matchups are ahead. What gives you the confidence that you can play your two best games ahead? Um, all the work put in behind it, man. Um, I think nobody knows. I mean, all the work we put in and all the hard work and, you know, the, the long nights we put in, man. So um, just because I honestly feel, man, we haven't played our best game yet as a whole. Just, just me like, as an offense, special team, defense. So, I mean, this, um, it's, it's only up for me, man. And I think um, all the work that we put in, like, it's, it's only bound to happen. Washington's had a couple of tough games on offense, but they were really explosive yes, offense before that. What is it that makes them so hard to, um, to defend, especially down the field? Um, they're so they're multi-dimensional, man. They have so much weapons on the offensive side that they can get it to. You got um, three receivers, three really good receivers that can go up and get the ball. You know, good quarterback, Michael Penix. He can throw it. He can run it. Um, man, he's a good. He can control, control the offense, man. And, uh, the, the, the offensive line moves as a unit, so I think that's uh, also what helps them too. So I um, just got to be prepared for all, all challenges. Mentally, when you talk about, you know how much work you guys have put in, you see behind the scenes and how much hard you guys have tried. Mentally, what's the challenge when you get out there on Saturday? Maybe that the, you know it doesn't materialize to the games. I think you got to win the inner battle. I think that's that's the inner battle that um, you know coaches emphasizes every day. Um, you go out there. Um, it's just you out there, it's you, you putting in the work, um, you sweating, you grinding, you putting in the work in. So um, I'm saying trust yourself and basically trust your training, all the work you put in. Um, it's only you. So I'm saying winning the, in the battle as far as knowing your reads, knowing that you're going to be perfect. Not perfect, but you're going to do everything you could to make your job work. You mentioned Eric. What was it like? Seeing that performance that he kind of put on and kind of took over the game. Man, he's a great guy, great, great teammate, man. Uh, I'm blessed to be a part of his, uh, part of the team with with that guy, man. He's a he's a freak freak athlete, and uh, I just think, man, it's only up for him. Um, all the plays he makes, it's so lengthy and inside, so I mean, it's hard to get around him. It's hard to throw around him and throw on top of him. Um, but overall, man, him filling the gaps and you know flying around, making plays, being energized, man, just helps our, our defense ten times way more better. It feels like on the outside, the whole season hinges on this game. How does it feel within the team? It's, it's, it's ready for it, man. I think it's a challenge that you know we've all worked for our whole life. I think honestly, you know, you work for you work for opportunities like these to go out there and compete against the best. And I think you know, coaches prepared us very well for that. Awesome. Thank you, Thank you.